This video is to be used for educational purposes only and is not intended to replace individual research or licensed investment advice. Unique experiences and past performance does not guarantee future results. Trading stocks, options, and spot currencies involves substantial risk and there's always the potential for loss. Your trading results may vary. No representations are being made that any software or training will guarantee profits or not result in losses from trading. This is the JDFN Forex Report. Good afternoon. This is David with the Forex Report. Ahead of today's federal funds rate decision announcement, the overall popular opinion was that the Fed is limited in their actions as the current interest rate is already zero and raising rates would cause immediate damage to the already tattered stock market. This did not stop traders from buying the dollar ahead of the announcement. Even though the dollar was strong today, the stock market managed to also be relatively stronger than the high yielding currencies. So the so-called inflation trade where traders buy stocks and sell dollars is still not in play. When the markets approach major announcements from the Fed, it is common to see the traditional intermarket relationships between different markets to become temporarily disconnected until the unknown announcement results have been cycled. When comparing currency market action between today and yesterday, prices reverse much of yesterday's move ahead of today's rate announcement, yet they maintain stable retracement levels that allow traders to position themselves in good strategic positions ahead of the announcement. The Fed announcement did not leave traders with a rate decision surprise, yet they commented on the fact that deflation should not be of concern or that inflation was their main concern. After the announcement,